Next year for school, do you want to go to a real school or do you want to home school? Good morning! Hey guys, good morning and welcome to today's video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're new to our channel and click that bell icon so you get our <laughs> post notifications in your feed. Huge thanks to Hershey's Chocolate for sponsoring this video. Today's video is very, very special. Do you know why, Ollie? Why? Because chocolate. And we have had the craziest day already. We've been out running errands. We've already eaten lunch. We're back home. So I think it's time for a little bit of a get together. What do you say, Ollie? Let's have a pool party. Yes, we can go in the pool and we can invite all our friends and family over. Yeah. Summer is my all time favorite time of year because we can swim in the pool, we can relax in the sun, and we love to invite our family over to make s'mores. Because I don't know about you guys, but s'mores are probably my favorite summer treat. S'more time! It is s'more time! Yeah. Roasted marshmallows. This is literally my favorite thing to do. All right, who can make the biggest, most burnt marshmallow of all? We gotta get in the fire. Yeah. S'mores are one of the most easiest things to make because we always have the ingredients. It's just Hershey's chocolate, graham crackers, and marshmallows. And it's so convenient when you've got a fire pit and you can just chill around the fire and... All right, looks like Papa is making the biggest, most burnt marshmallow he can oh for this s'more. <laughs> it melts the Hershey perfectly. Oh, that does look delicious. You gotta have just a little melt in it. Hear that, Finn? You gotta burn that marshmallow so it melts the Hershey's chocolate. Hey, Ollie. What? I think you got something on your face. What? A little bit of Hershey's chocolate on there. <laughs> I'm about to make myself another s'more, but I just had to say that making s'mores is one of my favorite things to do with the family. It always brings us all together, and it's one of my favorite memories as a kid. We used to always just go to the beach, make s'mores, sit around the campfire, and it was always the greatest time. Hey, babe, you're way better at this than me. Can you make me something? <laughs> of course. Oh my gosh. I'm just gonna love this up. I am about to make the most yummiest golden crispy melted marshmallow you will ever see. Now can I jump in the pool, Mama? Yep, go ahead. <laughs> Best day ever! <laughs> uh, you have a little chocolate on your face, you know. We always have it in our pantry. If you guys don't have any in your pantry, head on out to a store and go pick up some s'more supplies so you can have a s'mores party with your whole fam. Get it, Carmen, get it. Oh! <laughs> We are totally enjoying this summer, but I do have to bring up one thing that nobody wants to talk about. You guys are gonna be really mad at me when I bring it up, and it is school. It's something I've been like thinking about a lot lately. I still have not decided where the kids are going to go to school next year. It's so bad. I have been debating a lot of different things. The kids actually went to private school last year. I've been looking into charter schools. I've been looking into like other options in private schools. The one that we were going to is kind of a long drive. So I was kind of thinking, what if we tried homeschooling next year? So I want to know from you guys, what kind of school do you go to? Leave it down in the comments. If you are homeschooled, if you go to public school, what your kids do and why you like it or why you don't like it. I'm still trying to decide if we should homeschool or not. I think homeschooling could give us a lot of freedom. We love to travel with the kids and I think that can be really educational for kids as well. But I don't know, what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. Should we do this? Let me see what the boys think. I want to a real school. You want to go to a real school? Okay, well there's Finn's vote. Hey, Ollie. Ollie, I have a really important question for you, okay? What? 
<laughs> Next year for school, do you want to go to a real school or do you want to homeschool? Homeschool. Really? Yeah. Okay, well there's the what the boys want. I don't know, I have a lot of reservations on all of the options, um, so I would love to know what you guys think. Let me know down in the comments. All right, we are done in the pool. Now we gotta go get dressed. <laughs> You are one crazy boy, aren't you? Ba 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 be a guy bull. Ba 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 ba. Bo be a guy bull. <laughs> Draco, how are you doing this fine summer day? Look at how uh, full he looks and how he's standing up right now. It's pretty funny. Isn't he so cute? Yeah. <laughs> By the way, yes, we still call him a him. But if you don't know, he is actually a girl. And I have the video linked above of Ollie finding out. He did like a whole gender ah! reveal party. It was hilarious. Now that we just enjoyed all the fun summertime, we are totally gonna put on a movie and have some snacks and relax. All right, I've got the kids settled in for a little bit of rest time, and now we're gonna go hang out on the couch with a movie. It's like a perfect summer day. This is like my favorite thing to do. Dinner time! How was your guys' movie? Good. You had a good time? It's a beautiful day. Yes. So we are outside. Yep, we're having a nice, summer evening here. Ryan, I was actually just talking on the vlog about oh, yeah. how I'm still trying to figure out the boys' schooling. What do you think? Oh, what should we do? Yeah, do you think we should do homeschool, put them back into real I school? I don't know. I don't know. I was in public school my whole life growing up in Idaho, so. Mm -hmm. I was private school and then homeschool. So we have like all of it here. Yeah. It's, it's a really hard decision. I will say I education is really important to us. We really want our kids to have like a good education, but yeah. It's just I would prefer our kids stay in a private school, but I would love something like a lot more convenient or hands-on or closer. Yeah. Or like even a part of our own house would be cool. Yeah, I really, I think that my kids, not not just my kids, but every kid has a different learning style and it's yeah. really important to find that style and make sure that you're like nurturing it and not just like saying, learn this out of this book and if you don't get it, then whatever, I guess you fail. And I yeah. just wanna like make sure my kids get the proper education and that's I perfect I just wanna make sure that they're like, have opportunities to pursue like their own dreams. You yeah. Know, like. I mean, you were like an artist and he didn't really get to pursue all that until after school. So yeah. we just have a lot to think about. But now it is dinner time and it's a beautiful, beautiful night and I'm excited to enjoy it with the family. Uh, Brian? What? What's on your nose? Nothing. <laughs> um, there's something on your nose. No, there's nothing on my nose. I mean, I'm pretty close now. I mean, there's definitely something on your nose. No, there's definitely nothing on my nose. <laughs> Brian! I'm just cleaning my nose, okay? I, I walked in and I was like, are you okay? I don't want to be one of those guys with an ugly nose. You know, <laughs> like a bunch of blackheads all over his I nose. I know, you take care of yourself. I'm I appreciate it. <laughs> you all game? Can I play you? It has been such a long, fun day, but it is definitely time for bed, so I'm letting the boys do a little bit of playtime before it's bedtime. Um, but I just wanted to give one more huge thank you to Hershey's for sponsoring today's video. We're gonna go ahead and end this vlog. We had a great time making s'mores with the family um, and just having a great, fun day all together. So give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye!